Tomorrow, the Denver Public School District is holding a public comment on its proposed school closures. DPS says closing the schools will save the district millions of dollars or enough to hire a couple dozen more teachers. But as Marissa Armas explains, many parents are already signed up to speak out in protest. Nearly three weeks after DPS announced its plan to close several schools, the district now hosting its only public comment meeting on the decision. They're just thinking about the numbers and that's not right. They're not really thinking about these kids' education and what they go through. Fairview parent Summer Patterson is one of dozens of parents signed up to speak on Monday. Fairview is still on the list of closures. I want them to know how this community is a family. Like everyone knows everyone over here. All the kids know each other. You can't take that away from these kids. While the district recently narrowed its list from 10 schools to five, Milo Marquez, the chair of the Latino Education Coalition, says the list for consolidation continues to disproportionately affect Latino families. Our marginalized communities, our Latinos that live in these communities, they face different challenges than, than other groups in other communities. Um, our families are most more than likely uh, to receive multi-language instruction in, in the classroom settings. We also know that a lot of our community members uh, don't have the means of transportation. Marquez is now calling on the board to put a pause on all closures, consolidations and unifications. What that will allow us to do is work with these families to make sure that DPS and the administration have really thought out this process and how they're going to support the needs of the community that are going to be impacted by the closures. Summer hopes all DPS parents unhappy with the decision will give their thoughts before it's too late. It's about the kids and not the numbers. So just speak up. Don't be afraid. In Denver, Maris Armas covering Colorado First. Sign up for public comment on the school closures has already closed, but you can still attend the DPS public meeting virtually or in person. You should head over to our website for more details.